Previously on Delos, we go on an epic adventure to the other side of the island and cook a fantastic feast for Lisa's birthday. We haven't been up this early in a while. It's just after 6 in the morning and I'm going to get us underway up to Ubatuba. We're going to try and motor before the wind comes up. It's supposed to be out of the north today. So we're going to hot off early, see if we can get up there and it um, should be cool. Let's go. We are on our way out of Villa Bella right now and oh, it was such an incredible experience. We met a lot of really cool people that I think we're going to see again in Brazil. But it's always an interesting thing trying to decide when to move on because there's so many more things that we could have done here and we were here for three weeks. But I mean, Brazil's massive. So at some point we just have to decide to move forward to explore other places. It was only a 23 nautical mile sail to our next anchorage near Ubatuba. The boat from our dear friend Felipe was anchored there at Flamengo Bay. So we decided to stay there as well and spend some more time with our new friend and his family. Also Felipe was so kind to take Lisbeth to the airport on the next day. Slowly but steady our time as a crew of six came to an end. It was time to prepare ourselves to say goodbye to Miss England and send her off to France where she will meet her French lover again. What are you doing Lisbeth? I really feel English sugar. Are you making tea? Yes, would you like one? <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> she realizes it's my last sale today, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> That's weird. Of the year. Against all odds, we've decided to <laughs> give Liz her passport back. She's leaving us for a Frenchman. What? How do you think about that? How do you think about that? I have. My I English think. is getting worse by the day. This is the British. British. <laughs> <laughs> The British passport. You're getting a Delo stamp for good service, duty. Duty. Good duty. Duty. Make sure to take up a whole page. Asvidamos stamp. But don't use your passport. Lose it so between now and it, tomorrow. If you say that you don't have it or you lose it, it's not my fault because now you have Can it. Can we have an agreement that no one's allowed to hide this? Uh, I won't hide it. I won't hide it. That's fine. You no promise. Problem. I promise. I was happy for Brian to have my passport for the rest of my life. <laughs> and we've arrived and it looks very chill. It's just a beach, lush island, it's raining, and Felipe is here on his boat with the fam. We're gonna rendezvous and uh, hang out. I feel like it would be beautiful when it was like bright and sunny and hot. It's still beautiful now, but even more so. It's nice to get out of Ilha Bella, even though we had a great time there. It was time to move on. It was our perfect first stop. We have friends too. Hey, friend! Hey, man. Amigo! Okay. I made you a present for your going away. First, the first thing you have to do is have a look at this. <laughs> your life was like this, and there was like your life going this way, and then your life to Cape Town was this way. So I feel like that was a big part of your who you are and who you became now. So I wanted to give you this. <laughs> and at the back it says, I, I burnt it. I was real drunk the other night, I burnt the edges. <laughs> But I burnt away. It says, "May Cape Town always be your rising sun." <laughs> May Cape Town always be your rising sun. You sweet boy. So. Cape Union Mart. And that's where um, you taught me where how to spit, Alex. <laughs> Come here.
<laughs> so this was his last Saturday on Delos. We're gonna go on a mission. Yeah, rum is gonna be involved. So I'm very excited. First step, drink rum. I'm a bit of an emotional wreck today. So we're gonna have some fun to send me on my way. Yeah. Woo! Okay, let's do it. are heading into the beach for a barbecue. You're and ready I'm to go. for the winter. Because I want to say, protect myself from the biting flies. Baraturos. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Wait, they're trying to set it up to hang a light from oh, it. It's okay. We're going to see if we're going to lose it. the ground, put the light on top. The light? We've got some delicious pork sausages. Garlic bread. Yeah. Oh, garlic oh. bread is a very good oh, man. Yum! Okay. Oh, it's the best garlic oh, bread. Oh, because there's cheese inside mm. of it. Mmm. Fish oil. What it was like. Oh my god. Are you sure you want to loop us up? No. <laughs> we got snails wow, in France. So good. Yum. Caipirinha making in the dark. <laughs> but we have a light You're above your head. Up. One castle light. That's why we got three of them. Oh, you did it my mouth. <laughs> Just this one to sit on your forehead. Oh, God. Just half a spoon, like. Oh, one spoon. Let's try one, one spoon. spoon. One, one spoon. Good. One full lime, peeled. Yeah, peeled. In. Yeah, perfect. The right way would be to have the, the macerator. 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 It's halfway between mashing and maceration. <laughs> What? Yeah, like a, a, a macerator or a macerator. You know what I mean? <laughs> so now we have the kasasha, which is normally like the majority of the drink. So people usually put. Let's just do that. That was probably like three shots, maybe maybe four. I have to ask Felipe what this crying business is about. Where did you first hear about it? We first heard about this uh, crying when we were our first night in uh, the yacht club in Ija Bella and the bartender there poured us a rum and coke and he said, I make it cry for you. And he poured some extra in. That's what we do in Brazil. We make the drink cry, pouring a little bit extra that you didn't pay for. Well, the actual capirinha in a restaurant Will be like a dose of cachaça. One shot. One shot. Measured yeah. properly. Yeah. Measured. So, well, whatever shot that you have here in Brazil, we'll say like, well, you have one shot, yeah. and then you have the cry, the the last drop of 
of tears. Yeah, the tears of the. So wow. the guy puts a little bit more and just for free. Yeah, it's the choro. Yeah, chorinho. It's a chorinho. Chorinho. It's like the, the, the crying. Yeah, it's for free. It's That's why it's dangerous. All it is is like cane, cane sugar liquor, sugar, lime juice, and ice. That's it. And it's like a full glass. Yeah, it's a full glass. So you it. It's fantastic. Oh. Fucking up with here. Do I can buy you a drink or two? I don't know where you are As I'm drinking in the golden sun You're with that show from Sainsbury's From the fruit and veg section And I bet she's got a selection of <laughs> It's about a drunk English girl You should know this one, right? <laughs> And I'm dancing to Michael Jackson And I don't really like Michael Jackson Would rather dance to Eric fucking Clapton This is bloody boring <laughs> What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? A lion no more I think I don't need to tell you that Lisbeth played us a few more songs that night and we enjoyed a few more caipirinhas on the beach together. And then the time has come for the last mission of this season's girl crew. A fantastic night swim back to Delos under the moonlight and with bioluminescence in the water. It was probably the most magical way to say goodbye to Liz. Unfortunately, uh, I was left to drive the dinghy, so I can't swim naked with the rest of the group. But uh, I'll try and find them and uh, show you a little bit of a peaceful swimming. Oh, oh look who I found! That's Brian. Can you pull me or something in one? Watch them. You wanna come in? Okay, no, pull me. No, I'm not gonna pull. Okay, I'll pull you. Hey, what are you doing in here, Brian? Uh, no more. The camera is done because it's time to just live life without the camera. <laughs> Goodbye, mates. <laughs> Good night. Last day on Delos for now. For now. <laughs> it's been a strange morning and a strange evening. It's the most magical feeling in my entire life. And I have to dive up again. Go Brazil! Wow! Feel good, got my favourite breakfast made for me by my favourite captain. What tea? Well he's making breakfast as well, he's doing pancakes and bacon. <laughs> it's a super calm, beautiful morning here in Ubatuba. Look how nice it is. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? There's no rain right now. No rain. Slightly cloudy, but way better than the past days. Yeah. Did you have fun last night? Yeah, last night was a pretty good, successful Delos 
party, I'd say. <laughs> I shaved my Ryan legs Dalton when I was in the awesome. shower. It took right about a f an hour, but I'm going out, smelling like a flower, and I won't be back till the morning. We all had fun, and of course, we ended it with a naked swim. <laughs> hey, look at, hey, look at, this is what I do when I do like a whale. Check this out. Ready? Oh, fuck. <laughs> I show you the I show you the whale then. Ready? Yeah. I, I need a blowhole. Delos invasion and that beautiful bird swimming naked. Your last breakfast on Delos. For now. Yes, yeah. It's like a, he says it like a threat. Yeah. For now. <laughs> this is my favorite breakfast that Brian had ever made. This is my favorite breakfast ever now. This actually beats a full English fry up. Whoa. Whoa. That's intense. That was pretty strong. What are we gonna do without Liz? We're gonna sit over there. <laughs> gonna clean this whole area up, I tell you what. <laughs> I dare you would. <laughs> I'll tell you that much for free. <laughs> well, today is the day where Liz is leaving us. Unfortunately. I'm really sad and it makes me really happy at the same time that I know that she she will be on an adventure now of love. At the same time, I can't imagine this boat without her. I can't imagine myself being on this boat without her. She encouraged me in so many different ways. You guys did it. So it's cool. my buddy out here. It's amazing for me to see her writing the Dallas Diaries and putting herself out there in such an honest and vulnerable way. I wish I would have the guts to do it, but I I don't. And I think that that's what the Delos project is about. It's not only about being a good cinematographer or photographer. It's about the person who you are, and the, it's about the vibe you bring onto the boat. So mystical, so magical. Wow, you goddamn princess! <laughs> this is who Liz used to be. This is Liz Nuneaton. And this is Liz Costellos. <laughs> Liz the sailor. I've been all around the world, you know. On a sailboat, tacking, jiving. <laughs> she is kind of the partner I have on the boat. I don't know how it's gonna be for me with, uh, with two couples on the boat and that, that really scares me. I'm really trying not to be sad for me <laughs> because actually I'm happy for her and this and this should be the main thing to be happy for Liz. I will miss her. I will really I will really miss her. So yeah, the last hour of Lisbeth on the boat. We're, we're having the debate of whether Liz should shower now or later or at the or marina. Or leave it to France. <laughs> or la la wait until she gets to see I've got to shave my legs, Felipe. It could take a while. Okay. There are other places to shave as well. That could take it's longer. Like a yeah. Yeah. Down there. For your last day on Delos, you get, it's like your last meal. Get you get shower. one last hot shower. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to the world of unlimited hot showers, but you get one last one. <laughs> So, this is it. Here's a message to you guys. Go away, Brian. I'm talking to the camera. If you know how, how I see you guys and how important you are to me, and I teach what I do, like... Alex, you've got this wondrous heart and you're just like going for it and you know your path and you're just gonna you're just gonna do it and I know you're gonna do it and I know nothing is gonna stop you I know no matter what happens you're always gonna be fine but thank you for your friendship and Lisa I've really enjoyed these past few weeks with you you know you have such a you're just such a good person you are such a good person and this is where words fail me because I'm trying to tell you all how I feel about you but words are so it's stupid Easy, you've made me want to be a better person Karen <laughs> for me you represent to me like an anchor and stability you've always made me feel 
not so comfortable and you've always known when I haven't been happy. I really love your own self-worth. Greedy. Damn you! <laughs> I've tried talking to you so many times trying to tell you how important you are to me and stuff, but we both sat there and we've been like, we don't have to say anything. Brian, you're fucking awesome, man. Please let me come back, please, please. You guys are the best, and you guys are my family. I love you so much, I love you so much. Oh, fuck, but I'm gonna Paris to be with a French man. I love you all so much. We've shared this incredible journey, and it's just the start. It's not the end, okay? It's not the end. It's just the start. This is so strange. Liz is leaving us. No, it's like a little birdie fly in the coop. Weird. Who's gonna wake up in the morning and pull back the curtain and say, Morning, <laughs> do you want a cup of tea? <laughs> and roll out in her little thong. <laughs> Liz was already on Dulles when I got here, so I've never lived on Dulles without Liz. Yeah. So it's gonna just be interesting to see, I don't know, how things change and the group dynamic changes and yeah yeah it'll be interesting for sure it's weird i was so happy we had like <laughs> such a cool night yesterday and it was a really good send off now the time has come i think within 10 minutes she will jump ship and philippe will take it to the airport big bag <laughs> big, wow. big bag a lot of cut up t-shirts in here <laughs> You have to, I want to see all of this. I love you! <laughs> what is she gonna that do? That was a strategic, a strategic yeah. move. What is this girl gonna do? <laughs> she gonna do it? Now the only thing she's left is her dignity. <laughs> Hi, Lizzy. We love you. <laughs> what a legend. First item. Hi, Liz. Uh -huh. I'm gonna be the cat tomorrow, bro! Ciao! Hey, Bye, guys! Ciao! Everything just go, okay? Thanks, okay. Thanks for the good times. Yeah, we will. Yeah, we will. <laughs> her popping into the room saying do you want an alcoholic beverage <laughs> on the down low nobody hey, needs hey, to know hey Liz hello hello, hello. <laughs> hello. Water. Water. is there hot water <laughs> Affirmative. <laughs> cheers Liz whoa <laughs> so weird what did she leave behind she left this behind <laughs> Her book and some her waxing, waxing strips. strips. <laughs> Empty in here now. Yeah, it feels so like already. It's like a huge difference. Weird. Oh, that makes me so sad. Like your book like that. Well, yeah, I just thought if I, I didn't want to leave it on a sad note. So uh, here is the uh, famous Nuneaton voice, just to let you know that I love you and I'm going to miss you thoroughly. So, au revoir. C'est vous plaît.
up next. Oh, I'm just sitting here on the bench and it's one eating right there. <laughs> we end up on the magical Ila Ancheta. There was a, a big prisoner's revolt and this was actually the the guardhouse. Explore an old prison and go on a night mission onto the island. Brian and Kaz are on date nights, and Brady and Alex are on date nights, so uh, I thought it was about time that me and this lovely, this little Austrian, we're gonna have our date night, aren't we? Yeah, we just opened a bottle of wine, <laughs> and now we are choosing a romantic movie, a romantic comedy. A romantic comedy. A yeah. romantic comedy, and then we're gonna cuddle up in here. Yeah, in this, let's get some blankets area. on the go as well. And then we hopefully won't feel so alone anymore because, yeah, you know, everybody here has a lover. <laughs> Even this one girl behind the camera has a lover. <laughs> I'm the strong single woman, but today I also want to have a lover. And I, chose I chose Lisbeth to be my lover for the day. <laughs> that can be arranged. Shut up, Lisbeth. What are we watching, Lisa? We are watching a movie. I hear there's a bit of uh, sex in it as well. Is it? Yeah. Um, I have no idea. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you sure you don't want to take these leggings? Bend your knees. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Brady. Sometimes I look at you and I think you know you're kind of shady. Oh, baby. Oh, his name is Mr. Brady. Mr. Brady. Man, oh, some people think you're the werewolf man. But I know you had a soul. I know that happiness is your goal, oh, Mr. Brady. You're not so shady, oh, Mr. Brady. You're not so shady, oh, Shazam! 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 This is the new Delos conference table slash editing studio. Hmm. It's a conference table. I didn't know that. <laughs> I thought you guys were all chatting on Skype. With each other. Yeah, we're just emailing each other back and forth. Hey. Are, you, are you ready for lunch? Did you get that memo? Trying to use up as much internet as possible. Mm -hmm.